what is this like Hey friends, it's Ibelise J, I-B-E-L-I-S-S-E, -S -S -E, and I'm back with another freaking video. Now, before we do anything, before we go any further, before you start actually watching the video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And while you add it, you can just go watch my other videos. Let me move this a little bit. So as y'all can see from the title of this video, we're going to be doing a hair video. It's rare that I do a hair video on my channel. And it's crazy because when I first started my YouTube, that's what I started it for, to do like hair videos and makeup videos. But it's like, I don't do any of those on my channel. So it just, I don't know, my channel just, it just is what it is right now. So the lighting right now is kind of like funny because it's like cloudy outside. So every time like the clouds move, it gets like lighter or darker. So y'all just ignore that. Like, it's okay. I could have set up my ring light over there and set up a whole like, but mm, no. So for this video, I'm going to be doing like a lazy extended ponytail. Y'all know with like regular like extended ponytails, they usually like flat iron all the hair, slick it back braid it up and then wrap like bundles around it. But we're not gonna be doing that for this video. We're gonna do, like I said, like a lazy version. Like this is something fast. This is something you could just do for the night, take it out tomorrow. Like, you know, something like that. I like hairstyles like that because I don't like keeping hairstyles in for too long. So once it gets like one or two days, I'm already ready to switch it up. So yeah, we're just gonna get right into the video. We're just gonna see how this is gonna work because I haven't done my hair like this in so long, so. So for this video, I'm going to be using only Shenanigans Hair Teak products. All these products is going to be in the description below, just in case you want to buy, just in case you want to look on her page, whatever the case is, just make sure y'all support, follow, like her stuff, share her stuff. Like I said, just support it anyway. Support is free. So I've been using this product for a couple days now. This is the Glow and Grow Oil. And I just want to say this product is so bomb. The smell is like kind of strong, but like I said, it just feels so good on my scalp. Like I like the little dropper. Like, I don't know, it just, it just makes me feel fancy. This product, bomb. Another product I'm gonna be using is the Shenanigans Hair Teak Edge Control. I've used this so many times. It's not too greasy. It doesn't leave my hair like stuck, stuck, you know, that I have to like pull it to take it out, but it's just, it's just perfect. It's like in the middle. Like this right here has to be like my favorite product, like ever, like that I've ever bought from anywhere, from any beauty supply, from, any business from any you know like anything and this is the shenanigans hair teak wax stick y'all when i say slicks everything down like this is the type of product that i could use when my hair is done when my hair is wet when my hair is dry like it don't matter like you know when my hair is like done and i got like a silk press i usually use it to like bring down my flyaways when my hair is wet i use it to like slick back like y'all honestly like y'all know i'm a huge gel person like i use gel all the time gel is one of my favorite products like Y'all know sometimes I use too much of it. In this video, y'all gonna see some of the leftover gel, but it's okay, I gotta wash my hair anyways today. But y'all, this like made me wanna throw away all my gel. Like literally, like this is one of the best products I've ever used. And this is me like as a customer speaking, like I'm talking about when I first tried this, like I was surprised how much it just slicks everything back. Like I had my mom try it, I had my brother try it. Y'all need to get y'all some of this, like definitely 10 out of 10. I will recommend it to anybody like y'all also have this detangle brush from her and like i said you can remove this little thing and it just becomes like separate piece it's just like i don't know i just needed this like we're gonna use this today to untangle my hair or detangle my hair i don't know i say untangle so i'm gonna let the plane pass never fails so in this video i'm also going to be using her edge trap or i don't know if i'm going to be using the scarf I prefer scarves, but I have both, like, so. But the edge wrap is just, like, a, like, thinner piece of, like, fabric, and you just wrap it around. It's silk, obviously. The scarf is silk, but, like I said, I prefer scarves because I could, like, wrap it multiple times, and it's, like, tighter. Y'all, this scarf is literally, like, so big, and say obviously say her brand like like i'm saying i like stuff that's like this like it's not just like a pink silk and she's like oh i sell scarf like no like she got she takes time so i told you i'm doing a ponytail and as far as the hair i'm just going to be using these bundles i bought at the hair store the brand is model model and it's in the style fresh curl that's it as far as the products that i'm using like i said this is a very easy style so this is how i've been wearing my hair for the past like couple I don't know, it's been like two weeks or something. I just haven't felt like doing my hair ever since I went to Tay Styles. If y'all didn't watch that video yet, make sure y'all go watch it. It's like, I don't even wanna do my hair anymore. Like she did my hair so good that 
I feel like when I do it, it's not gonna look the same. So I don't wanna do it like, I really haven't done my hair since she did it. And like I said, like, it was just so like perfect. The, everything was just so perfect. I'm just letting y'all know right now, when I take off this, um, this bun, my hair is gonna be terrible. Like I haven't like brushed through it in like a couple days. It's just, y'all just leave it alone. So yeah, we're just gonna get started with this video. Um, obviously y'all need the basic things like bobby pins, like hair ties, brushes, combs, and all of that stuff you could get in Walmart, in the hair store, like just anywhere. Y'all see like it's already, what is this? Like just embarrassing. So before we go any further, I think I'm gonna change my hoodie out because I already know like my hoodie's ready to be so white because like I said, all the like leftover gel conditioner. <laughs> Okay, y'all, I just put on this gray pullover that I got from Walmart. So we're just going to get back into the video. So basically, this is what my hair is looking like. It looks really bad. Okay, I'm not even going to, we're not even going to get into that. I'm trying to think, like, do I want like a higher ponytail or like a low one? I think we're just going to do like a in the middle of the head one. So I'm just going to start off by untangling my hair just to like, give us somewhere to start. So for parts like that, it's just gonna be music playing over because I don't want y'all to sit here for like three, four minutes watching me do certain things like that or like brush my hair. So like I said, I'm ready to do this and it's gonna be sped up, so. Okay, y'all, so my hair is fully untangled. People have their own ways of like untangling their hair. Like some people use like the like the tangle spray. Some people like start from certain parts. Like I just untangle my hair. Look at how red my ear got. So basically I usually start off by like figuring out where I want my ponytail to be. Like I said, I want it more of like a, I don't even have a mirror. Hold on, let me go get a mirror. Like I said, I want more of like a middle, like I don't want it like high and I don't want it like too low. So I'm just gonna do like a middle. We're just gonna start off by getting a hair tie and basically like putting your ponytail where it's supposed to be, but don't like do it tight. Like I usually do it like, I'm gonna show you. Like just like a little bun or something because I don't be feeling like holding the ponytail while I try to like slick this down. So we're gonna start off by taking out our edges, whatever edges we want to use. I have like a lot of broken hair, so I call those my edges. I don't do too much with my edges. I just like literally take some out. So that's basically how we're going to start off. So like I said, just take your edges out however you want your edges to look. If you want a little bit, if you don't want no edges, you just want to slick back, however you want that to look. All right, y'all, I lied. There's two products that I'm going to be using that's not part of Shenanigans Hair Teak. So this is the first product. It's Pure Zero Moisturizing Conditioner coconut milk y'all this is so bomb and i'm also going to be using this cream of nature um just like i don't know foaming mousse this is bomb like i said both of these products bomb so with the conditioner i'm just going to be mixing that into my spray bottle just because i don't like using only water because i feel like that dries out my hair a lot however your hair slicks down slick it down like if you have to like flat iron it if however you want to slick your hair down just make sure it's in a ponytail So now I'm just going to be taking the foaming mousse and I'm just going to be applying that. I just take my wax stick and just like start like going through my hair, bringing any hair down. This product definitely like made me use less gel, like I said, because it's just, I don't know, you just like bringing the little hairs down. That's what I use gel for, to bring like my little like flyaways down like y'all don't see them right now but they be there so so now that you got your hair like as like slick as possible you got all your products in now you could actually like tighten your ponytail usually i use like the headband type of hair tie and i just like wrap it around twice and then like put my ponytail up. So we're just gonna do that right now.
Y'all, so this is my ponytail all slicked back. As y'all can see, like, y'all, that wax stick, like, it's just amazing. Like, it don't leave my hair too greasy. It don't leave it too, like, tacky. It's just amazing. So if y'all scalp tends to get, like, dry like mine, then, y'all, I highly recommend this part. So basically, I just take some of the oil and, like, press it or, like, rub it against my scalp before I do my edges because, y'all, I don't know. Like, when my hair slicked back, I feel like... I don't know, this right here just gets extra like flaky like. And like I said, this part is definitely needed for me, so. But this oil is even good to put like at night, right before you're about to go to sleep. You just like put a few drops like in your scalp. And I'm telling y'all like the next couple days, like you could literally smell the product still in your scalp. Like, but the next couple days, y'all scalp is gonna be feeling so good. Like, so after you put your oil or whatever, I don't do my baby hairs right now. If y'all do them right now, then that's on y'all. I don't usually do them. I don't know, only because I don't like them like real stuck to my head. So I'm only putting the scarf on so the oil like doesn't drip anywhere. And so like the front could like still lay flat. So like I said, I prefer using the scarf over the edge wrap when I'm doing like ponytails and stuff only because the scarf tends to be tighter. So right now I'm just gonna turn around and y'all just gonna watch me do the back. Okay, so as y'all seen, I just wet my ponytail because I feel like it looks more in place when it's wet and I don't know, it's just easier to hide and stuff like that. When it's dry, it tends to get more like puffy looking. So this is what the hair looks like. As y'all can see, wait, it's still in the neck. So yeah, it's just like, like I said, just like a curly, it's not body weight. So usually when I'm doing a look like this, I always start with the longest bundle and then I take the shortest bundle. I don't ever use like the middle length to do these type of ponytails because I feel like it looks too much like the longer one and it just looks big like it just looks like a thick ponytail like i like this one because it gives it more of like y'all see more of like a layered look or whatever so basically we're going to take the longest ponytail you're going to unwrap it don't like separate it no leave it with the two parts together and it'll just make it so much easier you don't have to wrap as much so basically we're going to start off by taking the bobby pin and like sticking it let me show y'all right about like right here so you're gonna stick it right there. So we're just gonna wrap the bundles around your ponytail. Like this has nothing to do with the actual like braid. Like this is just gonna be hidden. Put it in like your head and just start wrapping. So again, I'm gonna turn around. Y'all gonna watch me do it. So once you reach the end of the bundle, you're gonna take another bobby pin and stick that through and just like put it into the ponytail. So this is basically what it's looking like with one bundle. Like I said, now we're just gonna take the shortest one and keep wrapping. So it's just gonna be like the same process. She was trying to cook on to a nigga, but it's too late. Put the flight to Cali, racks and condoms in my suitcase. And every single dollar in these fans got a blue face. Diamonds in the world, and AZ like it's Blu-ray. Okay, y'all, so y'all seen I like comb my fingers through like the ponytail because I just don't like how perfect like the curls was. So right now we're just gonna do our baby hairs a little bit. I'm kind of not feeling how the red is looking with the black, like it just looks kind of weird. I'm just gonna take like my little hair lipstick, like it's like more for like gray coverage, but I'm just gonna take this and like color in my red because I feel like it looks very weird right now, so. <laughs>
Okay, y'all, so I just drew on like a little sweatshirt, a little black sweatshirt, just so I could take my thumbnail and stuff like that. Let me just say this real quick before we end off the video. If you want like an extended ponytail done right, y'all go book with somebody like, or learn how to do a real one. This is not a real one. Like I said, this is a lazy girl ponytail. If you don't feel like doing your hair one day and you just wrap it up, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, get some bundles, put your hair in a ponytail and just wrap it up. Like, this is like a quick fix. Like I'm saying, like, just in case you're going somewhere or, you know, something like happened last minute and you need a quick hairstyle, this is what it is. Like, if your hair is a little thinner and a little shorter, then you can use body wave, you can use straight. I just prefer to use something like bigger. Like I said, all the links to the products that I use is gonna be in the description below. So yeah, that's basically it. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you wanna see more videos like this or whatever I have coming up on my channel, make sure you subscribe and turn on that post notification so you know every time I post.